plan on traveling ever again and you don't want to end up looking like this or this or this or before i give y'all the seven key points just go watch that video they tore her up to pieces but let's get down to business number one natural repellents here are the essential oils that you need to travel with so you don't run into this problem lavender tea tree peppermint and eucalyptus mix a few drops of each into a spray bottle with some distilled water and get to soak in the area up needless to say do not ingest these things and dilute them please that's why we put water inside of it key point number two diatomaceous earth it's a natural non-toxic powder so you can sprinkle it around the area what this does is dehydrate the bugs and it kills them but i will say don't make the mistake that the others did use the food grade and follow the safety precautions when applying number three steam treatment steam helps get rid of the bugs and the eggs i don't know about y'all but my mother was really big on steam cleaning and portable pressing steam cleaning all that type of stuff amazon got handhelds get you one and use it next we have encasements now i'm not saying you got to travel around with plastic and all that type of stuff but even in your household i ain't saying you gotta wrap up the entire house but they do make encasements for these particular objects we need to be a little bit more mindful when traveling to begin with especially with airbnbs and stuff like that because these are other people's homes and x y and z next i know it isn't our job but vacuum no matter where you go no matter whose job it is or not keep your area tidy and the last two come without explanation well i feel as though it comes without explanation declutter the area we all know that bugs and vermin like to live in the dirtiest most cluttered piled up places so if you're traveling a rule of thumb that we do is everything stays folded everything has a place everything is spaced out everything is organized because the dirtier the more susceptible you are to being in situations like this now all in all we must take into accountability that we need to be clean people and always monitor our surroundings and even if this is their job to clean at least i know for us black people we clean everything no matter we clean everything but also source out and make sure that what you're getting involved with and what you're paying for is worth it but i hope this helped y'all god bless have a good one. Oh, and go follow that girl because she took her time to make this video